Princess Serena, not Princess Serena. And today I'm bringing back the Disney bag because I'm gonna show you part two of my Disney haul. So a few weeks ago, I showed you my merch haul from the parks, Disney Springs, and my hotel, Pop Century, and even the airport, actually, the airport Disney store. But that has only scratched the surface because this arguably is a better haul because what's better than Disney merch? Disney merch that's on sale. Now that's as rare as seeing a rainbow behind the Disney castle at Magic Kingdom. But before we get into the haul, I'm also going to be showing you a look inside the outlet on Vineland. So without further ado, let's go shopping. It's such a treat to go to a Disney store, let alone a discount Disney store because they closed all over Canada and of course so many US locations as well. And there were so many great deals, like 99 cents for an autograph book, yes please. And there were so many cute little shirts, bing bong, and 2021. So if I wanna get a cute 2022 shirt, I just have to wait till next year and it'll be like half price. And so many stuffies. And these ears are so cute but they're really heavy and then of course we got to check out the pins which was basically half hero and villain pins to be honest and they were from last year's pin event but i guess they weren't too popular but they're so pretty and then there's some sets for a steal of a deal like that's a price of not even one pin at the park and you get two and it's just a great place to come to get pins for traders i'm better than the booster packs at disney because these are even less and i love how many pixar heroes versus villains pins there were and then there's even cheaper OE pins here as well. These were only $4.99. And then we have more of the heavy ears. I wish these didn't light up because they're so cute. I would love to have balloon Mickey ears. These are so fluffy, I'm gonna die. Wait, that's a universal reference, my bad. Look at all of these Disney shirts. I'm looking at them all. I'm like, why didn't I buy this and that and that? But it's okay. I'll live through my mom as well because she got a ton of things I didn't get, which I'll have to show in a different video on the channel no place i'd rather be oh, i'd love the design of that one and this christmas one is gorgeous i would have gotten it honestly i don't even celebrate christmas but i love the style of it but there are only extra smalls left and that's a risk you know going to the outlet uh, there's a lot of nice things but when they don't have your size and you're just looking at a flood of like 20 30 of them it's just so sad but we never learn from that pain do we because we are the queen of this disney kingdom according to that hack and there are so many beautiful shirts some of which were italy ones that had nothing to do with disney like i know there's a pavilion but still very confusing animal oh my gosh and the pizza planet one speaking of that pain of not having my size rip i wanted that very badly baymax oh my gosh on a scale of one to ten how would you rate your pain i love big hero six but when i say i like big hero six i really mean i really love baymax and i spy the shirt that i'm wearing right now and yes it has a fun back surprise hey it's hey hey and this mickey mouse one is so cute i love little subtle disney 1928 because that's when like mickey mouse came about oh these are rad oh my gosh with all the writing it's far out side effects of staying at pop century may include using outdated slang <laughs> These characters are jumping at me. <laughs> oh my gosh, ba -la, -la, la la stop. I had to have a moment and fist pump Baymax. Oh my gosh. I want to meet Baymax. Is he at the parks? Because like, I love him so much. There is so much Big Hero 6 merch. What? I actually thought I was going to collect Baymax as like a side collection when I first started collecting Disney pins seriously. But I had one pin and it just didn't really stick. I ended up trading it and I don't collect him. It's interesting. Like sometimes you really enjoy a character or a movie but you don't enjoy collecting said character or movie and what the heck why is their 50th merch oh my gosh another 50th merch item like what i thought they would wait at least until the 50th is done to like bring them all to the outlets very strange there's still many months of the 50th to go and i actually got this sweater for my grandpa i'm excited to give it to him i absolutely love the sleeves 
Yeehaw, that pin looks like a bandana <laughs> pin. I mean sweater. Oh my gosh, there's lacking of pin content in this video, clearly, that I have to say pin. We'll get to the regularly scheduled pin programming really soon. And oh my goodness, I loved the color of this. But the year was pretty prominent in the front, so I couldn't get myself to buy it, unfortunately. I clearly had a Dory moment and forgot to buy that hat because I loved it so much and I didn't grab it. You don't have to wait till October to celebrate Halloween. Who says? It is like midsummer ween right now. Um, that's a thing in Gravity Falls. That Haiti headband, I can't even call them ears because they weren't ears, but like that was incredible. I loved it. And then this huge Oogie Boogie spirit jersey. At first I was like not sure what it said. I really had to stretch it out. That's a great find for big fans of Oogie Boogie. And the croc jewels, that brings me back. That sweater is kind of terrifying. It scared me out of the Halloween section and onto the phone cases. They were such cute ones. Like that boot door, I think is one of my favorites. The Gus Gus on the Cinderella one, stop. Like that was incredible. And the Cinderella was stunning. And all the princesses on here were beautiful. Like that Rapunzel one, of course, caught my eye. And then this is a spatula. How clever is that? I low-key wish I got that. And we got to close off on some pins. All right, so we're going to shake things up here and get a shirt from a festival I've never been to. Because <laughs> I just went to the garden one and then I went to the arts one in 2020. And this one's from the food and wine festival, which um that is a need. So like this shirt, you know what, Remy? We're manifesting my arrival next time. And then yeah, his blue is just like, bam, he pops and he's popping some pepper there in his meal. And you see all the buildings and you see the Eiffel Tower and it's just so beautiful. And it's shorter actually. I wanted to like show the whole thing because it's not like a full on t-shirt. Like the one I'm wearing is like long. Next up is like the exact opposite shirt so it's super long it is like so colorful <laughs> and you got the fab five or no you have the sensational six yes they included daisy we love that i don't know why D daisy is just excluded like fab five like is she not fabulous i think she is one of the most fabulous ones like her looks are you kidding they're diving into something and it says walt disney world and they're gonna dive into the next item how the TikTokers do it, right? My mom wanted to get a gift. So we went back in after hitting some other like outlet stores in the outlet mall. And you know what I found? That 100% was not there the first time I went. This Lizzie McGuire shirt. <laughs> it's Disney Channel just for me. How dare they like hold out on me? Are you kidding? Like Princess Serena, we need this. Seriously cool. How can I stay seriously cool when it was 40 plus degrees Celsius with the humidity and I just saw a Disney Channel shirt in 2022? How seriously cool is this shirt? And the colors are just like such vibes of like Lizzie McGuire. Um, and this is embroidered as well, like hello quality. And by the way, this was the cheapest item like clothing item that I got at the outlet. Actually, it was even cheaper than the pin I got, which I showed one outlet item in my last video because I was showing all the pins that I got at Disney. Freezing evil in its path, I love that. And then it's an Ellie 750. I love her pose, like, cause her animated self, like in the series was always so confident and like her alter ego, whereas like her actual like human self was very like, you know, low self esteem sometimes and like awkward, like she's 13, you know, she's navigating like middle school and life and it's just so relatable but like this girl she was sure of herself she's like i know who i am i'm lizzie mcguire like look oh and it's also shorter as well and again looser fitted this is definitely my favorite item that i got so that would have been the first thing that caught my eye like if it was up when i first went in but since it wasn't this rain jacket was actually the first thing that caught my eye so it's transparent and you have a bunch of nickies like this classic animation style like all over and it's interesting because it is i mean i'd like to think it's a rain jacket it definitely is like the material like i feel like you could even hear like yep that's the material um it's not it wasn't necessarily branded as a rain jacket but like it doesn't have a hood so i really don't know when i'm gonna wear this um i mean it is a fashion statement or i could get one of those cute rain hats you know <laughs> that'd be so cute wow i'm, I'm excited for it to rain it rained for exactly 45 seconds today. Um, that was our severe thunder shower. Um, yeah, 
that's Toronto for you. And now for my non-clothing items, I didn't get too many. So I got two of these photo frames on sale for 99 cents because I actually went to Disney World in 2020. So one's gonna be for me. I have to decide what photo to put in here. And then I also got one for my dad because I went with my dad on that trip. I mean, I know it's two years late, but hey, I didn't get a photo frame then. Like 2022, if I go to the parks in another two years, I could probably find for another 20. 20 cents, 99 cents. Uh, inflation doesn't go down, Serena. And then you have all the four park icons. And the last item I got were these Mickey ears. They were the only ears that like weren't super heavy. I wanted to get like a nice pair of ears, you know, for the parks and everything. Um, but unfortunately they were all the ones that like lit up and stuff. So they were really heavy and like thick and like uh, realistically, like I'm not gonna wear that. But honestly, like, I probably wouldn't have got these if there were like other ones that weren't seasonal, but I'm kind of happy I got these because I'm just gonna live in these in October, just my day-to-day -day life. Like honestly, like October 1st through Halloween, please, I'm gonna wear these forever. Aren't they adorable? Oh, and there's purple on them. That's so cute, I'm just noticing. I feel like when I show you, I like catch the little details. Um, but yeah, it's Mickey is a pumpkin, how cute. Yeah, I'm really happy with my haul. But wait, I have to show you what I'm wearing, of course. All right, so here's a closer look at my shirt. So it's like a rainbow, but it's not like the colors of the rainbow. I actually really like it. I like the color scheme. So there's like navy blue, uh, matches my nails here. And yeah, red, which matches like the whole shirt being red and everything on the sleeves, the collar. I actually really like that. I don't think I have a shirt. Like I have some shirts that have like a collar and like here, but I feel like none of them like connect. It's like kind of a really cool look, especially cause it's like plain, like the whole shirt is plain. So this is great to film in because I'm not like cutting off any of the design as well. Um, but yeah, and then you have like some twinkly stars and like you have the blue to match like the top of the rainbow and yeah really love it and then the back so this you think this is subtle disney right wrong there it is walt disney world 1971 50 years ago that's it for my outlet haul and roam around <laughs> i hope you enjoyed and if you haven't already please subscribe for more pin related content from me every tuesday roam around i don't think anyone has ever said that on the face of the planet anyway so i would love to know your favorite item that i bought and if you saw anything while i was roaming around <laughs> that you would have bought and as always, take care of yourselves and have a magical day. <laughs> Bye.